In this edition of Classic Movie Trip, I'm taking you to a cinema that's a little bit of a drive for me, Tyneside Cinema, as me and my partner Emma recently got to experience the Tyneside Cinema's Halloween All Night event. And whilst there, I got to see a couple of movies. <laughs> Hey everyone, what's going on? Welcome to the channel and thank you so much for checking out this video where today I am covering the second movie that I saw in the Halloween all night event at Tyneside Cinema and that is Wreck or REC, however you want to pronounce it and yes it is a 2007 Spanish found footage horror movie which I hadn't seen before so yeah again classic movie trip provides another movie I've never seen before. Yes, Wreck, I was highly in, kind of anticipating going into this one. I've heard just honestly great things about this movie. I've never heard anyone say this movie's bad whatsoever, but I try to keep expectations as such to a minimum because I don't want to be disappointed or overhyped it too much and be like, ah, it wasn't as good as I thought it would be, etc. So yeah, I went into this open-minded. And what I can honestly say about this movie, firstly, it is directed by Paco Plaza and Wame. Belaguero, if I've pronounced that correctly, so apologies if I've mispronounced the names. And the movie stars Manuela Velasco, if I've got her name correctly, who is Angela. And basically, this movie is all around a television reporter and her cameraman Pablo, as they are escorting these firefighters through the night, kind of just documenting them for this TV kind of special that they're producing. However, they go into this building, and from there, everything goes horribly wrong and i don't want to say more than that because if you've not seen this movie like myself i don't want to give you spoilers but what can i honestly say about wreck why is it taking me this long to see this movie this is awesome truly from a found footage perspective this is shot pretty darn well yeah there's an odd two moments here where there might be like a little bit of shaky cam and stuff like that and bits where you can't really see what's going on that's not really negative as such, of course, you kind of have that with every found footage movie, but this was based in 2007. Again, this is a Spanish movie with English subtitles, but yeah, with this movie, overall, the acting was awesome, the practical special effects were great, and the story overall was very enticing. Such a simple story about a television reporter following the fireman going into this building and stuff does go wrong, which I can't say what goes wrong because it's spoilers, but... Again, just such a simple story, but so well executed. This movie has lots of different emotions and layers to it. At times, you'll be smiling, you'll be laughing, you'll be angry, you'll be frustrated, you'll be stressed, you'll be tensed, and you just get all these different emotions throughout this entire runtime, where this movie doesn't overstretch its runtime. It's a welcome addition to its runtime. Heck, I would have even liked this movie to have been a little bit longer, say even 10, 15 minutes longer. I would have very much enjoyed that. The performances here all around are solid. I really like the setting here, the one use of the setting that they have. Well, one slash two settings here, really. They make the most of them. They just make the most of the simple concept that... I think is probably my favourite ever found footage movie. And I mean, that's a lot to say, especially as I've seen quite a few found footage movies. Wreck was a treat. This was a delight, more than I ever expected. And I'm glad to say that it exceeded any expectations. What I will say is if you are going to go into this movie, go in with kind of like no expectations and such, because I don't want you to be disappointed. Now, if you'd ask if I've got any kind of nitpicks or negatives, there's one. Literally one thing I pointed out in this movie where it's a little bit of a nitpick and it's something to do with the ending and something where I would have liked a little bit more explanation. Now I have heard that the second movie does explain that point that I wanted to explain which is great but for example if I was never able to access the second movie for whatever reason I would never get that explanation that I kind of want but again that's only kind of like a nitpick that I have so my overall score for Wreck is... A four out of five stars. Have you seen Wreck or REC? Are you going to go check it out? Leave any and all comments down below so we can continue the discussion down there. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel. 
if you already haven't and do you know that i also have a patreon yeah 42 pounds per month the link down below in the description box i want to give a big special thank you to all my awesome patrons who help support the channel and as part of patreon you get access to early videos my release schedules you also get to see what goes onto the channel and also a huge perk and announcement that i've made on there recently that is going to be a patreon exclusive where you get a say in a big project that i'm working on so yeah you can find all that down below in the description box but thank you so much for taking your own time to check out this video and until the next time that i see you i'll be seeing you later <laughs>